Arlington police were surprised to get a starring role in Grand Theft Auto, but for the department, this is no game. Now leaders are fighting back, saying their logo was used illegally, and they're not the only ones. News 8's Bradley Blackburn found several North Texas departments in the violent video game. So we're going to go ahead and just go code 2. These YouTube videos show just how real it can be. The swooping A design of an Arlington police car right there in the virtual world of Grand Theft Auto. All right, dispatch, let's just going to be six. But Arlington police right say it's a theft of their property. They'll use these car graphics. I guess you can download them into the game, um, and then you can do all kinds of stuff that we wouldn't really uh, approve of. They're called skins, created not by Grand Theft Auto, but by third parties, then added into the game. These screen grabs posted to Twitter are what caught Arlington's attention. Last night, we were alerted by a citizen that said, hey, we noticed that your car graphics are not only being used, but they're being sold by this graphics company, uh, just to make you aware. Whether they know it or not, many departments have skins in the game. We found videos of Dallas and Fort Worth police vehicles in Grand Theft Auto. Circumstances like this are why Arlington police filed for a copyright. You can see it in writing on their wall, protecting their car graphics and other designs. Our patch, our badge, our vehicle car graphics. Arlington PD tweeted the creator asking them to cease and desist. They wrote back, we were unaware and intended on honoring law enforcement officers. We we apologize and have removed the likeness. It's just a game, but Arlington says it's about control of their image. That a lot of times uh, people will take these types of images and use them in nefarious means sometimes. Guarding against theft in a whole other world. In Arlington, Bradley Blackburn, Channel 8 News.